Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I'm Bilal Abdul Karim coming at you from northern Syria. Everybody's been hearing all this talk from Western governments. No, my God, they're gassing children in Syria. Everybody's been hearing that, right? Uh oh, <laughs> wait a minute. There are warships and aircraft carriers on their way. And some of them have already arrived in Cyprus two days ago. Wait a minute, this attack just happened last Saturday. Three, four days later, you've got warships, planes, and everything standing at the ready to attack Bashar al-Assad. Now, hold on a second. I ain't defending no Bashar al-Assad because he gets what's coming to him. And so does his Russian counterparts because of all the people that they killed out here. But listen, are we supposed to believe that these governments, the British government, the U.S. government, all of a sudden now they're like, are they killing people in Syria? I didn't know that. We're going to have to go to war to stop this. This ain't about no Syrian people, and this ain't got nothing to do with gassing no kids in Douma, because they've been doing that all along. This is over 200 chemical attacks. Why now? Well, later on this week, we're going to be discussing why now, but I'm just letting everybody know right now, this has nothing to do with helping the Syrian people. It has everything to do with furthering their own ambitions, and we're going to be talking about it, but look, just letting everybody know, don't fall for this rhetoric, okay? They're not coming to help the Syrian people. They're doing it for their own reasons. And we're going to be talking about it later on this week. I'm Bilal Abdul Karim, coming at you live from northern Syria. Let everybody know, yo, it's coming. This week, we're going to be talking about it and exposing some people. Is that a plane I hear over me? Oops. Assalamu alaikum. Got to go.